All right, the final lesson in this uh, globalization unit. So we have got uh, two, what's that, three, five, five, seven, seven lessons here. Um, now, just a note on, on the globalization topic. Uh, the globalization could be linked to individual identities, attitudes, and behaviors. I, I think that's going to be really wordy in an exam question. I'd be very surprised if they use that. I think the mo if they do ask about globalization, it will be um, discuss how globalization influences behavior or evaluate research on globalization or... Um, uh, discuss the research methods. I don't think they're going to talk about that other bullet point, which was the interaction of local and global forces. Um, so I wouldn't, I, if, uh, when I teach globalization, I'm not worried about that exam question. I'm not preparing students for that. Now, that does, that, there is an element of risk there with that, because what if they do talk about the interaction of local and global um, forces in global, globalization and behavior? Well, yeah, that's tricky. They'll just have to do their best. But uh, I, my general approach is not to prep students for every possible study. I prep them for the most plausible and probable, sorry, the, every possible question uh, in the exams. I prep them for the most plausible and, and probable questions. And so that's just my general approach. Again, it's not without risk, but um, that's just how I like to do it. Okay, so in this last, uh, this, is just a, this is just unit review, um, if you've got the time. Don't worry, I'll sort out these animations here. Um, we come back and look at the key terms from the key terms uh, traffic light. So end of the unit here. Um, uh, if there's anything that they still need explaining, then now's a chance that they can do it. Um, the flashcards, I can spend some time reviewing on that. There's also in the unit plan a link to a Quizlet with all the digital versions of the flashcards. Uh, hopefully they can finish the crossword puzzle. There's a, a Jeopardy here, the always popular Jeopardy, a Quizzes, the Kahoot. And uh, this is quite an interesting longer lecture by um, Lyons Padilla. And in it, she talks about a second study. So the first one that we've looked at was just take uh, took place in the US. And actually they also replicated the study in uh, Muslim immigrants in Germany. And they did another the 200 participants there and they got very similar findings but there was one um, particular difference but if, uh, if students are interested um, they can watch that uh, it's um, yeah another interesting talk and uh, so they might want to finish their notes or uh, this to me um, is the most probable question that they'll be on the exams for globalization this or um, discuss one or more research methods used to study globalization or evaluate one or more research methods used to study globalization I think really they're the only three questions that they will ask but I can't guarantee that so uh, all right, that's it. That's the end of the unit. Uh, so I, I, I hope you, you like it. I hope the resources are helpful. I hope your students now feel confident in uh, and prep for their exams. Good luck.